Actually, then, Mr. Corcoran was faster on the draw than the duck, than an English Bob. Faster? Faster was his mistake. If he hadn't been in such a goddamn hurry, he wouldn't have shot himself in the toe with that first shot. He would have killed old Bob. Look, son. Being a good shot means quick with a pistol. That don't do no harm, but it don't mean much next to being cool-headed. A man who'll keep his head and not get rattled under fire. Like as not, he'll kill you. But if the other fellow is quicker and fires first, then, then he'll be hurrying and he'll miss. Look here. That's about as fast as I can draw and aim and hit anything. More than 10 feet away. Unless it's a barn. But if he doesn't miss, then he'll kill you. <laughs> yeah, that's why there's so few dangerous men around, like old Bob and like me. It ain't so easy to shoot a man anyhow, you know, especially if somebody's shooting back at you. I mean, that'll just flat rattle some folks. <laughs> Let me show you something. Just, just, just a minute. Look here. I, I know, just take that. Go on, take it. All you gotta do is shoot me. And you and Bob can just ride on out of here free as birds. <laughs> it is it isn't is it loaded? Wouldn't do you much good if it wasn't. First you got to cock it. Go on, cock it. Now you got to point it. Go on, point it. Now all you got to do is pull the trigger, mister. Hot, ain't it? <laughs> you need to put your finger on the trigger. What if, what if, what if I gave it to him? Give it to him. <laughs> you, don't, you don't really want me to give it to him. I guess he don't want it, Mr. Beauchamp. You're right not to take it, Bob. I would have killed you. 